top 62 to tie 63 to win Jakob Kivior. And Rob Holding will be serving for him. Remember that record 110 as well. That would win this event and would smash through for Arsenal. Ty Havertz, one of the other real big signings for Arsenal this year. Like uh, you know, Tackle Amon, we talked about him as a prospect, right? A golden boy of starts. Ty Havertz was such that player for Bayer Leverkusen. Then uh, on to Chelsea for the past several years and now to Arsenal. 20 points for him to get some points back in a big way. I'm not sure I'd be shocked if he has a big season for Arsenal this year. And the reason why, listen, there were frustrating moments for Havertz, Christian Pulisic, a number of players at Chelsea. Yeah, he had the big one, right? Scoring the game-winning goal in the Champions League final against Manchester City. But I just feel like Aaron Ramsdale over the past couple of days, just talking about the energy and how he looks free being at Arsenal, I would be shocked under this system with Arteta if Kai Havertz doesn't turn around what was a frustrating time at Chelsea. He's up to 42 in this round. 20 to go to pass up MLS's score. Now 16 to go. These are double. Remember, that will do it. 20 points for Havertz. And Arsenal is going to now go up 2-0 in the overall competition. He can still go for that record or close to it. He, he won't get there. So Lucas Elrond's 110 stands as the record. He'll make it 2-0 Arsenal over the MLS All-Star. I love how these guys, they almost, the, the kids start to come out with them. You saw the first one. He took a really sloppy touch. And you can see all of his teammates sitting down behind him, having a laugh about it, giving him a little bit of